What's up my people? Welcome to my YouTube channel, Life of a Farmer, Love. Here we discuss farming in details. I remain your uncle, Ishokri Ovokerori. You can call me Ovoruns. Please do me a favor and click the subscribe button, click the bell icon and like, share and drop your comments in the comment section. And to all my old subscribers, thank you very much. I love you so much. This video I'm making is a continuation of the previous videos which I uploaded some days back. I uploaded a video when the beds were 3 days old and today they are 7 days old of the 500 broilers that were brought to me which were very weak. So today being their 7th day, we are administering Gomboro vaccines. After administering antibiotics and vitamins for 3 to 4 days via their drinking water, then uh, we place them on uh, plain water for the fifth and the sixth day and today being the seventh day we administering gumburu vaccine due to their short maturity period we only have to administer two vaccines and mind you these bears are being raised for eight weeks we are targeting the x months period which is 24 to 25th by 24 25th there will be eight weeks so that is our targeted market so this best now we want to administer gomboro vaccine so the gomboro vaccine what i want to stress on is how you can make sure or know the quantity of water to dilute your vaccine with and if you want to administer vaccine any of these vaccines can come first you see that you give them gomboro first or you give them lasota first whichever way first thing you should know is the quantity of water your bears can consume within one to two hours but if by chance you don't know then stay till the end as i will give you a trick of how you can measure the desired water to reconstitute your vaccine in administering the vaccines you have to ensure that the beds are not sick and you must also make sure to starve them of water for a short period of time to enable rapid consumption of the vaccine and also you have to increase your drinkers due to the rush for a drink by the beds so what you need to do is to get the desired quantity of water these vaccines they normally come in dosage maybe in 100 doses for 100 beds 200 doses for 200 200 beds, 500 doses for 500 beds, so on and so forth. And I'm still going to tell you how you can share this vaccine. For instance, maybe you have um, 300 beds and you bought 500 doses. How are you going to share it? What you need to do is to get the desired quantity of water and you can also choose to administer through plain water or you might mix it with milk for the beds, whichever way. So when you open the vaccine vial, you have to be careful not to pour it on the ground, especially Gomboro vaccine. So if you are opening it, open it right inside the water, not outside the water. When you open it inside, then you mix properly. Then you cannot split into the different drink and give it to your beds please if you are new do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to all my old subscribers thank you so much and god bless you please don't forget also to like share and drop your questions in the comment sections kindly do this to help me to grow my channel so i want to tell you how you can know the quantity of water you need to mix your vaccine sweet and for you to know this two methods are involved the first one is to measure 10 mil per bed at seven days old that means each bed will consume 10 mil of the water at that seven days so you will now multiply the number of beds by the 10 mil that is for instance i have 500 beds now i'll multiply the 500 beds times 10 mil which will now give me 5,000 mil. So if you have 5,000 mil, divide by 1,000 to get the numbers of liters you need. So also make sure to increase the drinkers in this method. So with this, you're able to know. Then if there are um, 14 days, you multiply by 2. That means you increase it by another 10 mil. 7 days, you use 10 mil. 14 days, you use 20 mil. However, if you don't have enough drinkers, 
there is a second option before the day before this the seventh day of vaccine administration maybe on the fourth on the fifth or on the sixth day you starve the birds for few hours one to two hours give them feed and allow them to eat the feed then after one to two hours you give them a measured quantity of water for instance you can give them 20 liters of water share it among them and give to the birds then after one hour or maximum two hours withdraw the water again then you now make sure take a measurement of the remnants of water that is the water that they drink they they, they need consume you have to measure it and you now subtract the total the the water that is remaining from the of water that they've consumed within one hour so if i'm to mix my vaccine i'll mix it with the quantity of water the that they consumed within that one hour whenever you administer your vaccine and you have left over please don't pour it on the ground for me the best place that i normally throw my vaccines empty vials and um, vaccine water vaccine water that is remaining is in the septic tank in nigeria we call it sokawe pits or the waste chamber best place i normally throw my vaccines into mind you it's best to give your ba- your bears vaccine in the morning when the temperature is low and also make sure that when um, transporting your vaccine the cold chain should be maintained from the point of purchase till the point where you administer the so from what you can see currently as of today these birds they are seven days old and they are doing very well when they are eight weeks so now i want to show you how you can separate or share your vaccines assuming you have 300 birds and you bought 500 doses of the vaccine what you need to do is mix the vaccine measure five liters of water ensure that the container you are to use is calibrated accordingly and pour your water to the point where you have five liters of water after that mix your vaccine inside that water and remove two liters from it if you remove two liters from it the remaining one what you are having left will be three liters so that three liters is now what you will now mix add extra water to to mix your vaccines i believe it's as clear as a b c thank you very much for being part of my life i value you so much all my new and old subscribers and if you haven't subscribed yet please kindly click the subscribe button and don't forget to also click the bell icon so that you get notification anytime i upload a video please do this to help me to grow my channel god will richly bless you see you in my next video peace out